Well, this Rusty Glove Box today, the mad scientist, and we're going to generate some hydrogen gas uh, from a very cheap, inexpensive generator. I've kind of looked at them on the internet a little bit and so run across this design, and it seemed pretty cheap and pretty simple, and it generates some gas on the internet, so I was going to give it a try, and uh, let's see what happens. Well, we're going to get started on building the uh, hydrogen generator now, and so what I'm starting off with is some stainless steel uh, scouring pads. Uh, bought two packages of them and uh, you're going to need some wire and uh, some sort of container and uh, so first I'm going to thread this wire through this scouring pad and uh, it doesn't have to be a soldered connection or anything so that is all attached then you take a sock make sure it doesn't have any holes in it So you've got your sock with the steel wool pad on the inside and the wire attached to it. And next you take your other steel wool pad So now you take your other wire and go through there with it. So now we've got a negative and a positive wire. I'm going to use a zip tie. Here I've got a, a mason jar. I put a little bit of baking soda in it and uh, that's supposed to kind of help uh, counteract some of the reaction with the stainless steel and the electricity and the water uh, whenever it's generating hydrogen. Alright, so next I took the ring uh, from the mason jar and used a coffee can lid and just made a plastic ring because I was going to have uh, these electrical wires running through it and everything. So. Okay. 
All right, next I'm gonna drill a hole in here uh, for this plastic tubing to fit through the lid to catch the gases as they uh, ball off of uh, stainless steel and the, the water. And so uh, let me get that done and we'll come right back. 